about to book your hotel in London, well, here are some important things that you should know before you do it. By the way, if you're new here, I'm Jess and I make videos for people who are coming to visit London. And this video is part of my Book Your London Hotel series. There's no best area to stay in. There are lots of great areas to stay in in London and each of them offers something different for a different type of traveler. So if you need recommendations of where to start your search, I have a couple of videos that I will point you to at the end of this video that will help you out. Hotels are relatively expensive. You've chosen to visit one of the most expensive cities in the world, and so the hotel prices do reflect that. So you'll just need to manage your expectations and expect to get a lot less for your money here than in most other parts of the world. Central London is the most expensive. So all of the hotels that are in the most central part of London, which is near like the major sites and attractions, relatively speaking, those ones are gonna get you the least for your money. So if you're on a budget, then I would start to expand your search outside of that very center. We have all of the major hotel chains here in London, but we also have some really great boutique hotel chains like the Firmdale Hotels and Citizen M. So don't be afraid to branch out from the names that you usually know and usually stay with. Always book a hotel that is just a few minutes walk from a tube station. Some hotels will advertise that they're a short bus ride away from the tube, but actually a bus ride can add a ton of time onto your travel time if there's traffic or if it just doesn't come very often. So your best bet is to always make sure you're staying within about a five minute walk of a tube station. It'll cut down on your travel time significantly. If you're planning to party on a Friday or Saturday night when you're in London, then you can save yourself some money by staying near one of the stations that's part of the night tube, which runs all night on Friday and Saturday nights. That way you won't have to pay for taxis to get back to your hotel. I'll leave a link in the description of the video that will tell you which stations and which lines are part of the night tube. The best area and the best hotel to stay in in London totally depends on you. Just figure out what you wanna get out of your trip. Do you wanna be right by all the major sites and attractions, or do you want a little bit more of a local experience? That will help you to figure out which area is gonna be best for you and also which hotel. If you need some recommendations for areas to start your search in, I have two videos as part of this Book Your London Hotel series, which you can watch by clicking the card that's popping up right below me. Of these, oh, I got distracted. Tube, the right, yeah. No, I'm gonna say again. What am I trying to say? Let's give it a second. All the taxis.